Hi guys, Jack here with Berryland Campers, Pontchartrain, Louisiana. I want to do another uh, little walkthrough with you guys. This is a brand new 2023 Dynamax DX3 34KD is the floor plan model number. I will do a uh, walk around here on the outside, just kind of point out some things. And again, as always, for more details, you can check the description or reach out to me, and I'll give you all those details at the end of the video. We did order this one with the blackout package, so you're going to notice it's got some black wheels, some uh, you know, grill covers, and things of that nature. This coach, of course, is equipped with full body paint, backup and side cameras. It's got your built-in Gerard awning there at the top, um, as well as all your side hinged baggage doors, which is nice. Comes with a weight safe drop hitch. In case you ever wanted to a certain size trailer, you'll see that's got a lot of up and over style storage above the chassis rails there. And uh, I don't know if I'll open up all these, but just a few of them to show you the, the amount of storage there. Um, of course, slide toppers on all the slides. And then I'll walk around the rear. One thing that I want to mention, this is more of your towing style motorhome. Um, not that you have to, but it's kind of what it was intended for. You'll see the class three hitch there. It will tow up to 20,000 pounds. It's a currently a three inch receiver. So that has to be a uh, size down quite often to a two um even like your three quarter ton trucks a two and a half so this one's a little rarity but we usually keep the sleeve that makes that into a two inch that way you can tow a regular car behind it which at this point this wouldn't even know it's back there um, this does have the washer and dryer you'll see the vent there you also have the driver's side scare light for at night if you're trying to dump tanks or whatever it may be i will open up a few of these on this side as well this one's nice because it's actually passed through all the way to the other side. It does have lighting in the compartments as well. This one I wanted to go over. Um, it's got a lot here, but just to kind of, it's your wet bay. Everything in here is going to have, you know, reason for it, obviously. Labeled, lights. Um, this does have a macerator, so that's what you'll see there, that gray box in the center. To the left, you'll have the retract wheel for the hose. Um, you do have hot and cold outside shower you attach the coil hose here and then of course you can do what you want with that wash pots pans um, animals or of course your feet from the sand if you're at the beach things of that nature it does have black tank flush uh, low point drains again everything's pretty much accessed in this one compartment which is nice so that can go up here your onan 8000 qd which stands for quiet diesel um, and all your hydraulic lines and pumps in there as well and of course storage there and the others as well as batteries you'll see the slide topper there on top of the main slide which opens up nicely when we go inside i'll show you that you do have dual fuel fill on the m2 chassis which is nice again this is a true truck chassis it's not a custom chassis from freightliner it's a true truck chassis so therefore it's meant to do the job um, most people's not trying to tow near this, but it can and is capable of doing so. You'll see that you have the one dual fuel fill on this side, as well as the DEF. And then as we walk around, which this has the tilt up hood, black grill for that back out package. Then you'll see the other inlet for the fuel here as well. So uh, side camera there, marker on the side. Keyless entry, do have exterior TV here with sound. And when we come in here, I turned my battery disconnect on already. Just locate it there on the side. Underlit countertop edge lighting. Solar controller here. You do have some slide controls and your jacks here. A lot of that can be worked off of a different system, which I'm going to show you in a minute. This does have, of course, your standalone radio as well as the separate TV for you know camera viewing so it'll actually have four splits i'll have two rear cameras on this model and then your left and right camera so what's nice about having the two splits you can see one goes straight down from the motorhome so you can see if you're hitch, hitch, hitching up to a trailer car whatever it may be backing up to a concrete slab or one that's more lifted up more vertical with the motorhome that way you can see what's actually behind you out in the distance this does have a push-up bed so you could sleep here if you wanted to you could sleep up to two adults um, weight wise i think it goes up to 550 pounds this has a firefly system in it, which is nice. Uh, of course, you can hook up your phone to this. You can control all the lights in the motorhome, your generator, which this does have AGS, autogen start, um, temperature controls, slides. And then when you hit the confirm button here, you'll see that you can do the leveling from here as well. So 
you have two ways to do that as that panel I just opened on the left driver side as well as this one here on the passenger. What's neat about this is you can go to the mobile app screen here in settings, put the information in on this screen and pair it to your phone, whether it be, you know, Google Play Store or the Apple Store. You can go download this, scan it, or just put the code in, and then that'll mirror to your phone, and you can do all that stuff that's on that panel from there as well. Hard surface countertops, induction stovetop, residential fridge, deep, large, and then you 